In this video, we're going to show you how to optimize and repair your database with WP DB Manager. Optimizing your database is definitely something you should do every so often, and this plugin suggests that you do it once a month. Uh, you can do it less frequently if you want, uh, but there's certainly more to be gained by doing it regularly. So if you're looking to do that through the plugin, it's really, really super simple to do. All you need to do is go to the database menu and then go down to optimize DB, and then you can see all of the WordPress uh, tables in the database and as you can see on the right hand side here we've got yes tick next to them and to optimize all you have to do is then click on the optimize button it's very 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 quick to do uh, it's already been completed because it just runs an, a MySQL query uh, on your server and it will definitely help you make your database fast and responsive which is exactly the way that it should be next you can also choose to repair your database so it's just the next uh, option in this plugin that you've got and for the most part, you probably won't need to really run a repair on your database. It's only in the instance that something's actually gone wrong with your database where you need to do that. So, but that said, you can generally run a repair even if you just want it for no reason. Uh, it shouldn't actually cause any harm to your database. So we're gonna do that now. You'd see it's actually got all of these tables set to, yes, we wanna do a repair. So I'll just do that now. And there you go. So it's already done. Once again, it's very, 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 very fast to do although there wouldn't have been anything that it could have done in this instance anyway, because it's a brand new database and there's uh, nothing wrong with it so far, but you know, things can go wrong. And I think it's just important to know that you do have this as an option. So that's all there is when you want to optimize and repair your database. Uh, there's not a great deal to know. It's very straightforward to do, or at least this plugin makes it really easy to do. Uh, and certainly make sure you optimize your database, uh, you know, every so often, every month or so just to keep things running in check. If you have any questions about what we've done today, please feel free to ask in the comments below.